Okay, here it is on Channel 4. Our gear from a North Hollywood music school on Thanksgiving Day, and they belong to Ozzy Osbourne's guitarist. But today, a woman found some of the gear in an alley. Here's NBC4's Gene Kang. Officers carefully removed priceless items dished in a recycling dumpster stolen from the Musonia School of Music. Irreplaceable memorabilia belonging to legendary Ozzy Osbourne guitarist Randy Rhodes and his family. I knew when my gut something was wrong. Bobby Fredericks first saw the stuff in the open dumpster as she walked her dog through North Hollywood. She placed everything in a dry area out of the rain, then soon realized it wasn't trash. My uncle Randy was a, was a very important piece of rock history. Nick Dargenzio said his family received several tips after Ozzy Osbourne posted about the robbery on Facebook and Instagram yesterday to more than 15 million fans. Osbourne even offered a $25,000 reward for the Thanksgiving robbery. <laughs> Rhodes taught guitar at the Musonia School of Music in North Hollywood before he died more than 35 cool. years ago, where fans from around the world visit on a pilgrimage. Not far away at Sunny Slope Avenue and Burbank Boulevard, police found a stolen trumpet that was given to Dolores Rhodes by her great-grandfather when she was a child in the Great Depression. The trumpet is valuable just because it's my grandmother. She passed away recently, and so, you know, this is her legacy. Officers took everything. They even double-checked this recycling bin, but the family says they're missing the Holy Grail. Rhodes' first electric guitar, a Harmony Rocket uh. from 1963. Meantime, Dargenzio and his family eternally grateful to Fredericks for finding their rock and roll treasures. In North Hollywood, Gene Kang, NBC4 News.